All right. So we just hit record button. Hey, YouTube. What's up? Um, so we're going to. Wow, I just messed my hair all up. Hell yeah, I can still do this swipe over to the left. My hair's not completely falling out yet. Um, sorry, I'm here, but playing Apex. That's that's cool, dude. Play Apex, man. I get it. It's a Wednesday night. Um, way to date the video, by the way. All right, so Cortex Power. We we've got we've got quite a few levels left. I think more than I thought when we ended stream last time. Audio even getting picked up here? Oh, this is me super low. That was this thing. Go. Oh, that sucked. What? Can't. Okay, I see it. Cortex power. Okay. That was dumb. It was very dumb of me. Oh no, we're not doing that. We'll go this way. That was a dumb idea. Chat. That was super dumb of me. Don't don't mind me. Um big dummy. Big dummy right here. Okay. All right. Maybe we'll go left. What's left? this thing hell yeah we killed that what why does bro get guns why does bro get guns we don't get guns i don't remember this level Chad, am I supposed to like remember this level? Cause I don't. At least we got a lot of one-ups. Oh, is it not gonna let me uh I guess not? Okay. Ugh. Wow. Wow. Wow, wow, wow. Okay. I guess I need to just walk off. Don't like what am I hitting? Yeah, give me that life. I mean, we got plenty of lives from last time, but. Is it a bubble that hit me? Like, there's nothing I can do. Huh? Chat, what am I doing wrong? Nice. Don't like this. Dude, I didn't touch it. He said I touched it. I didn't touch it.
I realize I don't need to jump there, but I do it anyway. Bro, we got some apples coming. Hell yeah. Dude, get owned. Crap. Yeah, I was about to say that box was probably important. Oh. That's it? Huh. Okay. Whatever. <laughs> I'll take it. The generator room. Okay. The generator. Bro's just like creepily watching. Okay. Why do I feel like this is important? There's nothing up there. I don't like the... Yeah, I don't like that. Don't like that! <laughs> Crash is just staying in there like nothing's going on, whatever. I really don't like these end platforms. Hello? Rose got too many devices on his network. I, I could feel it now. This is a guy who has a lot of devices on his network. What's up, Rusty? Your Discord? What about my Discord? Oh, yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah, I'm in here. What's up, dude? Jake. Saw, dude. What's up? Just hanging, you know. Try not to die. The huge. It's a Wednesday night. Surprised you're home. Then I remembered you have a normal job now. And you can do things that that us no oh, I fell. You can do what things us normal people do now. Sometimes. And it's not bowling night. And that just reminds me, Sean was saying something about playing Power World tonight. He was playing it earlier when I got home and now he's on Hulu. He might be watching wrestling. Actually, he texted me earlier, and I think he meant to text his boss because I just got this text message that said, uh, hey, uh, do you mind if I uh, if you got enough people, do you mind if I stay home tonight? And I think he just missed. Oh. He meant to text his boss and not me. <laughs> I was just like, uh, uh, from hoppers. Yeah. And I, I, I don't remember what I was doing. I was at Walmart. I think I think I was picking up prescriptions and I was just like, what? Why did you text me this, bro? Oh, no, I was leaving the doctor. Okay, yeah. Dude. Power World is goaded? It probably is. I need to... We need to play it, Stevie. There's a new game that got released today, too. Yeah, I saw a bunch of people streaming. 
I'm on a death cycle right now. What game? Jesus. Echelon or Ascension or something. I can't remember. Sounds like an RPG. Very much um, like a Valheim style game. Yeah, that's what that sounded like. Oh, okay. I, it, it doesn't look like he can hit you from that angle. And I just jump off into oblivion, whatever. <clears throat> uh, okay. We're good. Ah! There, we launched that dude in the stratosphere. But I want to go down here. It's down. Ah, oh, why? How dare it tempt me? Oh my god. It's like 10 deaths in a row. So, how was your day? How was work? You have fun. Did you learn anything new? I'm literally having the conversation. I, I'm literally having the convo I have with my daughter every day <laughs> when I pick her up. So what did you learn today? What did you do? I played. We didn't get. Uh, okay, whatever. Uh, new album released. All right. Don't soft lock again. <coughs> okay, cool. Yes, save. I'd very much like to beat this game tonight and then we can do the, the wheelie wheel. That's what I want to do. How, how much time have you put into it so far? Uh, well, we're getting close to the end. We're in the last world. So like, it, it's getting there. It's just, what the hell is the pattern on this? Dude had a weird ass pattern. Oh, I'm dead. Why do I feel like if I fell there, it wouldn't count against me? Um, There's like two hours in this already, I think. So we're, we're getting pretty close to the end. It's not a very long game. We're not going for a hundred percent or anything. What is this one of those platform? Okay. That wasn't expecting that. Okay. God. Jesus. I've got to know. Can I just? No, I can't. Okay. I had to know. I had to know. Because it looks like you can just stand there. <coughs> and boom. Okay. You're just chilling, editing music. That's dope. I'm just chilling, playing a game that's uh, almost as old as my wife. Ooh, almost ate that. All right, another checkpoint. Good. Okay, why couldn't I just cheese that? Why can't this game let me cheese that? I should have been able to cheese it. <sighs> I 
that shouldn't have killed me. And make the jump. I don't like this. I don't like this. Oh, I don't like this at all. And now it wants me to go lower. I Okay. Is that a walk off? Can I just I'll jump. It's a jump off. It's fine. No. F those things, dude. No, I don't want to do this. Why? This is why I don't want to do this. At least they're not firing a lightning. And then just walk off. Okay. You know. Death cycle. Death cycle is indeed what it is. I totally uh, didn't know what I was doing there. Yep, my sentiments exactly, Stevie. Fart noise. I just want a picture of a god god dang hot dog. No. A picture of a god dang hot dog. Hot dog. Hot dog. I'm just singing cat dog at this point. Cat dog. Cat dog. See, Jake, you know how to do it. Oh, wow. I get three one ups for that. You got to the part of South Park where Garrison nukes Canada. That sounds so on brand for South Park. Another level. Great. What's this called? Toxic waste? Um, let me guess, there's going to be a lot of toxic waste. Kyle manipulates him into nuking Canada, then like goes to war. That sounds so, uh... <coughs> so I talked to the doctor today. She said I'm going to have this call for like the next 10 weeks because I had straight up a uh, coronavirus. Not not COVID, but like old school coronavirus. That's pretty wild. Yep. She's like, yeah, you just had a major respiratory infection. She's like, you didn't go to the hospital or anything, did you? I was like, no. She's like, I'm kind of surprised. I was like, well, I'm here. I'm not dead yet. I was like, as long as I can go on my cruise in two weeks. I'm a happy camper. Bro, strong as F. I don't know about strong as F. I'm dumb as F. Bravery and stupidity are a fine line. There was one night I probably should have went. I decided against it because I enjoy money. Money, 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 money. <laughs> I'm sitting here thinking those bubbles can kill me, and they totally can't. But that can. Oh my god. <sighs> what? Fucking guy in my game pissed me off. <coughs> Do 
Yeah. You got yeeted. I got very much yeeted. Oh, I wasn't talking about you. I was talking about the dude I just spun into oblivion, but... Oh, no! Oh, that sucks. What are you playing? Destiny. Uh oh. I see you like to suffer. Yarp. Well, at least it's not League. Nah, not that bad. <laughs> He's playing Destiny. Are you streaming it? Or are you just playing? Nah, just playing. I could hit the go button, but just playing. Not gonna lie, my streamer etiquette would be terrible tonight. Because I don't have a button for, um, push to talk right this second. Your condolences? Yeah. Stevie feels bad for you. He's okay. Can we get a feels bad man in chat? Stevie? Oh, hang on. There you go. <laughs> To see me when I rage in mutt. Dude, there, there's a perfect solution to that. Just don't play fucking mutt. Play Madden, but don't play mutt. And apparently somebody leaked the NCAA trailer. A guy on Twitter is claiming, or Instagram is claiming that uh he some anonymous source sent him the trailer, but he won't he won't send it out to anybody. And everybody's just like, dude, trailer it didn't happen. You're just clout chasing at this point. Yeah, that's poop. Believe me, I want to play that game just like everybody else. I will play that game more than most people probably. And I'll probably never touch Madden again. I say that, but if they let me import draft classes, I'll probably will. Dude, I swear, I just, like, do dumb things sometimes. I just walk right off the platform. <coughs> Did you see uh, Twitch change the payouts for streamers, affiliates, and, um, affiliates? yeah, affiliates and uh, partners? So you know how they have like the partner plus program where you can get the 70 30 split if you meet certain requirements. Sure. They have one for affiliates now. It's 60 40, but you got to hit 100 subs in a month. Interesting. And I'm you dead. Have to do it. You only have to hit it once. You got it. You have to continuously hit it. But they're doing the, uh, I think it rolls out in May, they said. I mean, I guess that's cool. It's, I, it's easier to probably get 100 con concurrent subs than it is to get 75 viewers. All mm hmm time. Yep. Well, and they also lowered the requirements for 70-30. Um, even affiliates can reach 70-30 now. I think it's 300, uh, 300 regular subs, I think is what they said. Martona. That's what I, I, you know, I put out a tweet earlier saying it would be nice to hit 100 congruent subs again. But, you know, nobody responded to it. Mike, Mike's been avoiding, avoiding my tweets. Uh, he's busy with his new lady. Yeah, he, 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 uh, he spent his money on his new lady. And his kids. He's got two kids. He's got two girls. Girls aren't cheap. You miss Mike? Tell him. Add him at uh, put, add him on Twitter, man. Known Mike a long time. He oh Jesus, I didn't jump. 
Well, I've known Mike a long time. He likes that shit. He likes the attention. He also likes to yell a lot, too. Especially if he's drunk, he just gets in this like really loud talking tone like, Hey guys, what's going on? Like that that's how legit how he talks when he's drunk. It's kind of funny. If he was here now, he'd be saying fuck you, Jake. But you know, it's whatever. Rust Rusty knows what I'm talking about. It's true. Damn it. I say fuck you all the time. Yeah, pretty much. It's fine. I think we're going to run out of lives on this level. I can feel it in my gut. I can feel it in my tum tum. When I do dumb stuff, it, dude, the, the 3D platforming in this is so random sometimes. It's not fluid like it is in Mario or, or uh, Mario 64. Mario 64, I know where I'm going to land at all times. And this, I'm kind of like, eh, I don't know. The tricky dicky platforming sometimes. <laughs> Finally. Eat that dude. Ah, there's the checkpoint. Hallelujah. <coughs> oh, wow, we're dead. Your highest engagement on Twitter led you to be blocked by someone in the hockey universe. Which was today? Who blocked you? Please tell me it was Sidney Crosby because all the Team Canada stuff. Yeah, please tell me. It was... oh, God damn it, man! No, it was El Friedman. Elliot Friedman. Am I saying that right? I don't know. Elliot. Okay, just say it like Elliot. Okay. Like E.T. Elliot. <laughs> he spells it out. He spells it the French way. That's fine. The French Canadian he's, he's way. French Canadian. He's a fake Frenchy. Yeah, he thinks he's important, but in the grand scheme of things, the only thing they're known for is being America's hat. He's a fake. Did French. I say that out loud? Just lost every bit of a uh, Canadian viewership I had by saying that. I'm not a big hockey guy. But, uh, what's that one sport where you like push the stone, you got the brooms? Curling? Curling's freaking dope. It's like the most drunken Midwest Canadian sport ever invented. Bunch of dad bods out there winning gold medals. Rusty, do you want to start a Can uh, an American curling team? I don't know if our knees could handle it. Although we have to get Sean to be the guy that gracefully slides down the ice. <laughs> Why Why Sean? <laughs> Because I think it would just would look the most ridiculous with his ponytail and then the He has a pony just, Is he rocking a ponytail now? Oh yeah, with his I, long hair, he's always I, going to open a ponytail. I, I haven't seen Sean in quite some time, so okay. Canadian curling sucks. Dude, we could probably get completely blitzed and still do that competently. It's just shuffleboard. Shuffleboard for younger people is all curling is.
pinstripe is the next level. Okay. It's a lot more difficult than that. Oh, I'm sure it is. I'm, I'm being, I'm being a bit of a douche waffle by saying that. Oh, it's a boss. Okay. This guy's got a gun. Used to be on the high school curling team. Is that is that what all the dudes play to get uh get the chicks in in Canada? If you're not on the hockey team, you're you're playing cur or you're you're doing curling. Please tell me that's all this boss is. Pinstripe pot. Oh, I haven't even damaged him. Curling MFers never got laid in high school. Oh, psh, bro, you weren't curling good enough. You, you didn't throw the stone and sweep the ice good enough. Maybe that's all curling is. It's like a tryout to see if you're going to be a good husband. See if you're good at sweeping. <laughs> Dude, I imagine curl it like. I imagine curling is like, uh, oh, his name's Pinstripe Potteroo, and just not Pinstripe Pot. I was going to say this guy kind of looks like pa Pedro Pascal there for a minute, but Pedro Pascal don't smile like that, dude. He got that kind of grin. Except in that, uh that gif with uh oh yeah 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 on air with whoever it is <laughs> all right all right all right yep oh that's not matthew mcconaughey that's nick cage then that one nick cage movie or whatever oh yeah 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 it's a good movie by the way highly recommend that movie oh, i'm dead dude why does this guy get a gun and i just get hoodala Dude. Yeah, sure, I get to take a bullet, but he gets to fire a Tommy gun. Why are you fighting Joe Pesci? <laughs> this guy's a lot taller than Joe Pesci, let's be real. I, mean, I was about to say that... <laughs> He's a rat, see? He's a rat. Nah, nah, see? Nah. He's a rat. You think I'm funny? Nah. Like, this feels like a effed up the Batman, the animated series villain. Like, that's what this guy feels like. He should be in that show. But, like, only if Pinky and the Brain took it over. Then it would make sense. How do you beat this guy? You gotta jump on his head or something? I gotta spin attack him. when. Oh, when he runs out of bullets. I keep getting caught on stuff. I'm about dead. <coughs> like when he comes when he comes out like that, he's not firing as heavy, you just punch him in the punch him in the, the family jewels. Punch him in the Joe Pesci. Yeah. Yeah, see him, yeah. Could they made more of an Italian stereotype here? I think this is where David Chase got the inspiration for Sopranos. <laughs> He just went to, he went to, uh, James Gandolfini and was like, I want you to impersonate this guy. I don't know what David Chase sounds like, but, uh, 
I, do, I can't even finish my thought because it's stupid. It makes no sense. Come on, jump down here. Stop going to the table. I know, Sopranos aired 25 years ago. I know, it's crazy. The guy's dead. Did you see HBO Max started doing the... Uh, so with, for the 25th anniversary of Sopranos, they did Sopranos episodes in 25 seconds and completely ripped off what Mad TV did years ago. It's like Mad TV did this bit. It's like Sopranos edited for for broadcast television. And it's just Tony's like, <laughs> Carmella, where's the gobble ghoul? And it, it just cuts to Carmella and she's like, I'll tell you where it is. It's shoved up here. And it's like three days later and it's the scenes like makes no sense because the show was nothing but cussing and sex. Uh, that's literally what all Sopranos on TikTok is. Thanks for talking, coming to my TED talk. I've never actually watched The Sopranos. Dude, I, I've i been rewatching it. it. It's pretty good. I, I've never gotten through it until, um, well, now I'm going to get through it, but. I haven't gotten all the way through it. We all know the ending. Everybody knows the ending. Jamie has a podcast and it's interesting. Jamie Lynn Siegler is just an interesting person in general. And she's kind of a 10, not going to lie. You mean the guy that plays, uh, what's his name? Never seen it. Uh, the guy that plays, um, Tony's son. What is this? Oh, okay. Oh, I'm a dummy. Probably gonna have to revert from a save. I want to keep going. Jesus. Remember, she, uh, J since you brought up Jamie Lynn Sealer. <laughs> Remember, she did, um, she was in that, uh, Lonely Island music video, uh, Jizz in My Pants. It was kind of funny. She's just like randomly in it. She was also randomly in Entourage too. Well, a, a, a person being on HBO. Yeah, she's a, uh, she's the, the checkout chick. So you'll read all the comment sections. It's like, oh, it's Tony Soprano's daughter working a regular job. And everybody's like freaking out in the comments. But she was also an Entourage, which HBO reuses a lot of the same actors for a lot of things. But it, it's kind of funny because she just played herself. And she ended up giving uh, one of the characters a uh, hand job on an airplane. It was kind of funny. Oh, crap. Pinstripe Polly over here. Got him. No guns in an E-rated game. Defeat. Pinstripe Puderu. I didn't read all that. Whatever. Yeah, the, the, the Sopranos ad that they did for the Super Bowl was pretty good. <laughs> I mean, it was just them driving to the driving uh, the Jersey Turnpike and the song from the show playing is all that was. <laughs> it was still good. The show was great. There's this dude on YouTube I recommend watching. His name's Pure Kino, and he just he reviews nothing but uh um HBO shows. And he was uh he's really good. I, I like his content. He I watched his synopsis of all of uh The Wire to see if anybody would uh who's here? Who just jumped in here? Are we playing slots? No, I'm streaming. It's Tanner. 
I mean, I'm I'm not opposed to playing some some slots a little later. Oh my god, I just died. <coughs> Did you want to play slots, Tanner? No, I just know you guys were in here the other night playing. And I saw you guys in here when I was looking to do something with WoW. And I was like, oh, let's hang out with them rather than doing a raid or something. Yeah, I'm just playing Crash Bandicoot. Rusty's playing some uh, Destiny. Just, just a bunch of bros hanging out, having a good time. Just a bunch of dudes, you know. It's just guys being dudes, man. Guys being dudes, yeah. it's... Just a digital sausage fest. That's what I love. It's what I'm used to and what I love. Made it. Oh, come on. I jumped on that turtle's head. Without Sopranos, there would be no Breaking Bad. No, well, without Sopranos, there wouldn't be a lot of shows. Up and over. I just want a picture of a god dang hot dog. No. You really want the picture of that hot dog, don't you, Stevie? Wow. I totally fell to my death there. All right. Thanks for joining me for some totally average gameplay tonight. Yeah, now I'm in a death spiral. Gonna have to beat Pinstripe Polly again. God damn it. It's fine. We got an achievement though. I wouldn't expect it to get, so it's fine. Jamie's 42. Jamie Lynn Siegler's 42. Bro, there's no way. She does not look 42. I guess that I guess that math maths though, so. You just Googled it? I'm telling you, she's in that Lonely Island video, too. Andy Samberg's just standing in the group. Or, no, not Andy Samberg. The other, one of the other dudes that nobody knows the names to because it's the Lonely Island. Andy Samberg's the only one that makes... made that group worth anything. Damn it. I'm dead. Who could be off? Punched him. Started watching a episode of a uh, Yellowstone on TikTok the other night because I don't know how many movies now I've watched or TV shows I've watched because some some movie boy on TikTok has uploaded half of it and I want I want context to uh, what I'm watching. Run out, run out. Ugh. Oh, God. God damn. About to choke on Chick fil A ice. That's not good. That chewy ice, man. It'll get you. It, uh, dude. You don't swallow it, right? Oh, no. Um,. Did you end up watching any more of ADG, uh, AGDQ? Yes. Um, I watched the the guy that plays Donkey Kong with um, the bosses in reverse order. It was pretty fucking cool. Dude, I watched it. Oh, God damn it. I watched a video about how to do that the other night. And I just like it's insane how they came it up is. with that. It's like, OK, so we can play this game 
starting at the last boss and going all the way back. Uh, that was pretty crazy. Um, what was the other thing that I watched that was pretty crazy? Um, did they do a task block this year? I think they did one where they played Metroid, but they're not doing task blocks really anymore. I know they did an awful block. Oh, um, Super Mario Sunshine was really good too. Was it? Well, yeah. That 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 uh that game in general is just fun to watch. Yeah, I just popped it on and it was just great background for work that day. Because it started like two and it was over like right when I was done, so it was like perfect. Out of context, Jake, or you want to start that subreddit now? Just out, out of context, out of pocket things I've said. Yeah, that's what I said. Pause. You don't swallow it right. Yep. I'm oh, getting uh, so close to beating this level and I keep messing up. What were you saying, Tanner? You saying that reminds me I need to watch the Starfield run because I did want to watch that too. I remember you mentioned that. Yeah, I forgot about that. They beat it in like 45 minutes or something. I think it was a half hour, but still, that's, uh, that's ridiculous. If it doesn't use a uh, cup or a uh, bowl... I'm going to be highly upset because Fallout and Skyrim both had that glitch. Yeah, we can just clip using, like, a small item like that. Yep. What am I doing? Move, turtle. There was a DK64 run I wanted to watch, too. Yeah. Um, um I know That looked that. really good. Well, I don't know him, but, like, um that runner up watched before and he's really entertaining oh, I'm dead back to do the boss fight again <clears throat> oh no kind of upset all the uh, Kaizo Mario guys don't damn it they don't do uh, AGDQ anymore or SGDQ don't they normally run SGDQ for um like the Mario Maker shit, like the Mario they, Maker. Races. They used to do like Grand Poo World and um, all the Kaizo games, and then they just started doing the Mario Maker stuff. And I like Mario Maker, but I like watching a game I've seen before played. You know what I mean? Not just some random yeah, levels. Like, it, like I understand it, it's impressive for them to just pick up a a Kaizo level like on the fly and beat it. But at the same time. The impressiveness of just watching a one death run of a Grand Poo World 2 is just it's mind boggling. And that's why I kind of like speedruns in general, right? Like I'll watch like some random runs of a game I've never played before, but mm -hmm. it's so much more enjoyable when it's a game that like I know, right? Yep. Like DK64, for example. Like watching <laughs> that is just like fucking mind blowing. So I remember that game took me fucking months to beat. Mm hmm. I tell you, a fun one to watch is like Grand Theft Auto speedruns oh, yeah. on PC. Like, just how broken they are. Because they're super broken. <laughs> Chick fil A did hit the spot tonight, though. Oh, there's some people hanging out on YouTube. Hey, YouTube. Yeah. Well, I'm dead. You know what run I'll go back and rewatch from time to time is the blindfolded punch out run. I knew from you well, I think you and I bonded over that one time. We were talking about it. I remember sitting in a hotel at Atlantic City watching that guy do it, and I was just like, holy shit. And then he did, like, every Punch-Out game, too. Mm-hmm. And he's doing it based on sound, not on... No, like, yeah. just everything's on an audio cue. So insane. And some crazy buffer strats, too. He had mm -hmm. a stroke recently. 
What? Um, he's like fine, fortunately. Yeah. But he had a freaking stroke. Dude's not older than us. Like he's. No, he's he, he's like our age. Is he? It's scary. It, it, he he can't be like more than forty. Ah, God damn it. <coughs> Come on. You know, I've never beaten this game before. All my years of playing video games, I've never beat. Never beat Crash. All right, we got some lives for the next stage. Good. Tanner, you might get to see the big wheel tonight, depending on how long you stick around. Yeah, I got some walking left to do. So. Oh, I GG's on your that. on your seven day uh your seven day walkathon that you've done. Thank you. Thank you. Yeah, I'm trying to fill all the rings. I've only missed a few days recently. I need to up the goal to like another 100 calories like 750 or something just to kind of push myself a little bit because now it's getting easy you know as long as i make it a point to walk for a while each day during work a little bit and at night it's easy and it's fun to do while gaming too you know i gotta get a mini treadmill or something oh dude it's great i've got a standing desk and a walking treadmill and it's it's great you only do like 1.2 miles per hour and you can just it's you your body really doesn't know the difference oh this is gonna be rough Whew. all right save point <coughs> as long as it doesn't soft lock my game again Bro. Want to learn some Metallica songs? Oh, you want to learn Metallica songs. Good luck with Rocksmith. I, I know somebody who bought that and it's probably still sitting in his his uh, closet with his next to his Transformers. You can play. That's dope. Oh, my God. Doing small jumps here, big jump here. There's the ending. <laughs> I feel the same way, Crash. Same way. Slippery climb. Oh, no. Whoop. Okay. Rocksmith does piano. That does not surprise me. Dude, there's been uh, piano video game peripherals for forever. Freaking the original Nintendo had one. I remember watching the Angry Video Game Nerd review one like that. Yep. Dude, have you seen him lately? Yes. Um, he is like severely balding, which yeah. I have no room to talk, but it just looks weird. He he shows off his tats a lot more too. Like I had no idea he was tatted until like oh yeah recently. Yeah, he's tatted and he's got his little uh, rock band as well too. Damn it. <laughs> they they covered the uh song that they used in Rocky 4 for like the the workout montage. 
and it's like his most down liked uh downvoted video ever because that, that's not what people follow him for they're not there for that they're there for the silly like shit that he makes i wish he would make board james again board james was awesome that was probably my favorite series he ever did that and I did enjoy Monster Madness before the controversy. Oh, I'm dead. And boom. Whew. Okay. I'm starting to sweat this a little bit now. All right, birdie. Thank you. Oh, Tanner, I was watching for tickets today, by the way, and nothing, nothing below 500 bucks without fees. Yeah, well, and apparently it's just supposed to be an awful day in general. Well, there's going to be there's going to be a rain up to uh an hour before kickoff. I'm dead. Thinking about who's hosting the Super Bowl. Well, I can say this it will I not be I. I know you're going to be on a cruise ship. Well, I'll be back, but that's literally the day I come back. That would be pretty dope if we were. You're just at the bar. <laughs> I was like, wait a minute, that's Rusty's dad. And Rusty gets a text from me, like, like it's just a picture of his dad, and he's just like, what the fuck? It's just Larry posted <laughs> up with a straight bourbon. Oh, I'm dead. <clears throat> the one good thing about the this cruise is I will not have to pay for alcohol. If I want it, no, my dad gets it for free because he's a degenerate who loves to gamble. So he gets it the moment he walks on the boat. So he's, he just looks at me every single time. He's like, you want anything? Just tell me. I'll get it for you. I'm like, okay. You're right about my dad and the, uh, the bourbon and whiskey though. I literally have a bottle of whiskey on my desk waiting for him. Ooh. Also, on that subject, Esther and I were kicking around <coughs> hosting uh, the Super Bowl party. So, if we all want to get together, we'll probably end up hosting that. Because we haven't showed off our, our house since we've you guys got our against new couch and shit. I'm down. More than enough room. As long as be on a fucking boat, aren't you? No, I'm, no, I'm, it's the day I come back is the Super Bowl. Uh, so long as the baby cooperates, I'm down. But if she's being a little a hole, I gotta, I gotta be dad. Can't duck, duck my responsibilities even if it is the Super Bowl. Oh, crap. And there was no effing checkpoint. I hate this level. <clears throat> patience, Jake. Patience. And... Ooh. 
It's the flashing. That, that's effing with my eyes. Overshot it. Booga booga. I meant to send this in the group chat earlier, but I would not be shocked if Mike McDonald takes the Michigan job. I'm just going to say that out loud. Hopefully he doesn't. Hopefully he stays in Baltimore. Planner, let me throw this out there. So I could be wrong in this assumption, but I'm assuming the last time you hosted a Super Bowl was when we hosted I, it for the Eagles. That is true. And the Eagles won. So that house has some good Super Bowl juju in it. It, it has some good bird juju. It, it does, and I'm knocking on wood as I say this, but I know some people who have quite a bit of money to gain if the Ravens do win the Super Bowl. Yup. I know I do. So does Zach. No, I took the bet on Christmas when they were plus like 400 when we came out and just started smashing the 49ers. How much did you put on it? 150. So it's about 900. Oh, it's, yeah, it's, yeah, that's good. What are their current odds? Like minus 150 or something? Oh, they gotta be the favorite. Let me look. I'm pretty sure they are. I made my bet back in. I think it was the day we re signed Lamar. I made that bet. I had some free money left. The 49ers are still favored to win. Yeah, plus it's like 40, but the Ravens are plus 200. Plus 200? Yeah. What are the Chiefs? Uh, Chiefs are plus 325, and the Lions are plus 750. Oh, man. Just throw some money on the Chiefs, or not the Chiefs, but the Lions. The Lions, yeah, that's great odds for only four teams being left. <coughs> if there was a team to win it that... If the Niners play this week like they did last week, the Lions can definitely beat them. And Debo did not practice, has not practiced this week yet. And if they don't have Debo, that's a, a good chunk of their offense. Oh no, damn it. Lame. We got this. No distractions. Get wrecked, duck. Weirdly enough, the 49ers are the favorites to win the Super Bowl, but Lamar Jackson is the favorite to win the Super Bowl MVP. Interesting. You want to know why? Because if the Ravens win the Super Bowl, it's very likely that he's the MVP. No, it's because he's locked the fuck in. John. Well, Johnny. Johnny. I. So who's second, Purdy or McCaffrey? Purdy. Purdy, then Mahomes, then McCaffrey. Dude, I ain't gonna lie. If Baltimore gets there, I'm 100% taking Kyle Hamilton to be MVP. The amount of games that he has showed up in this year like that, wouldn't it would not shock me. And that's the thing, right? Like, 
it's almost always the quarterback unless there is like a supernatural gain from like a defensive player. player. Yep. Oh my god, I don't know how I saved that. Come on, give me a checkpoint, please. Dear Lord. I see it. Oh, this is my last life, so the checkpoint don't... This is my last life, isn't it? No, I got one more. Okay. Don't fuck up. Well, that was close. Is Mark Andrews coming back this week? He uh, he, per Adam Schefter, he's expected to play. Yeah, Schefter's been talking all week about how he thinks he'll play. Practice fully today. So did Hump. Yeah, I saw the stuff on Instagram about Hump. <laughs> what level am I on? Uh, I'm near the end. Can't remember what it's called. Ah, oh, god damn it! Honestly, uh, I think I I hope we let we bring Andrews back in slow. Just where Isaiah's been so hot lately, and he's gonna have that rust. We'll see what happens. This guy's got a gun. No, he, he's throwing freaking explosives at me. Whatever. I've got to do that all over again. I've got to do that all the F over again. Slippery climb to answer your question. Mandalo. No, no, I'm dead. God damn it. Patience. Yeah, we need to get this life. I get the life and immediately waste it. Tanner, have you done any more uh, gambling since our Thursday night front fun? I mean, like, I'll place a sports bet here and there, but nothing like going to the casino, right? Oh, I was talking about the. The online uh, slots. Hell no. That's only fun like when you and me are together and watching it. Buffalo! I do want to go to the casino soon though. That would be fun. We all haven't been together in, since what, Rusty's 22nd birthday? together at B-dubs the one time the Eagles played, but was that... No, that was this game. No, I was talking about casino-wise. Oh, yeah. Gosh, we, haven't, we haven't done that in a long time. Technically, my bachelor party. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. But if you're talking just us, like, getting in a car and driving to Harrington <laughs> in the middle of the night and then going to Taco yeah. Bell, it's been a long time. Yes. Oh, boy. Those were the nights. Oof. That was before Ocean Downs, like, even had table games and shit. Yeah. <laughs> and... What did my wife send me? I'll have to look at that later. Oof. 
Quack. Now I understand why they said this is the hardest one in the series. Oof. Saved it. Get my timing right. The first one's the hardest one? Uh-huh. The, the, the first the first game's the hard one. Second one is um like the time bandit thing right or whatever uh i think the third one. The, uh, that would be the wrath of cortex wouldn't it i don't know to be honest i'm a bad streamer i don't know me Austin wrecked him oh no I got wrecked, wrecked him. darn near kill yeah, whatever yep darn near killed him that's a better one yeah And did you look at the um was it the AEW uh, uh do you look at those AEW ticket stats on uh Twitter by any chance? They were talking about it on Observer a couple days ago about how like there's less than 2000 tickets for like an upcoming show or something like that. Dude. Like it, okay, so they're doing a show the Saturday before the Super Bowl, right? So it's the Saturday before the Super Bowl. There's also a UFC event that Saturday and it's NFL's honors night. They've only sold like 800 tickets out of a, um, out of 2,500. But not even like, I mean, we're talking about in house, like actually going to the show. Mm -hmm. I hope they come to like our area again. We should go because we, Probably be able to get really good seats. Relatively cheap. If they do B more again, I'd be down to go. Because they normally run um, whatever the Royal Farms Arena is called now. <laughs> He's calling AEW 2001 WCW. I thought it was 2000 WCW. And I really just ran into that like a dumbass. I don't think AEW is done purely just because they're getting a no. ton of money from WBD, but it will be interesting to see with what WWE got. Oh, they've, they've already, they've already said what they got. No, with, For, with, with what they got with when oh, no. AEW yeah. comes up, what are they going to get? Yeah, well, everybody keeps saying that they think WBD has a stake inside of a... They, they own a percentage of AEW. And at this point, you would think that they have to. The way they tout it, and they're like, oh, we did the best numbers ever. I'm like, yeah, but not really. Well, I think that's more of just like a wrestling thing, right? Because, I mean, WWE always says we, the WrestleMania attendance is 95,000 people. No, like, but I'm. Fucking how? <laughs> they're touting the I'm talking about the ratings and the ratings don't even mean anything anymore really that's the bad part it's like it's not it's not like it was 
25 years ago when or 30 years ago when the Monday Night Wars were going on. They're touting having a 0. .6 and 18 to 35 or 34 demo or whatever and it's just like and it, it really doesn't matter cuz like it depends on either I guess how many pay-per-views you're selling or how many subscribers mm -hmm. you have. Uh, or in WWE's case how um However, if I'm one of the Yoshis of an Abbott, I won't take damage, however they won't be able to take damage. The um I saw the it was a stat since the oh, god damn it. Since the Netflix deal, hello. Oh, when did I cut out? Uh, my Sorry. Oh, you're good. It was like, uh. Oh yeah. Um, I'll just say the whole point again. Ratings don't matter. It matters nope. how many pay-per-views you sell. How many subscribers? Case, not so much how many subscribers, but how much money you're getting paid to put your show on whatever platform. Yep. <laughs> they um WWE is getting paid 800 million dollars a year for their product between uh, new money between CW um Netflix and USA for having Smackdown and I saw a stat that that was up uh over five, uh, it was 500 million a year. Now it's 800 million. And the Netflix deal is five billion dollars or something stupid like that. Five billion? Yep. Good lord. And Netflix is also taking care of international pay per view distribution now. So here in the States, we're going to be using Peacock still, but. It makes me wonder in a matter of time, how soon does they just move that to Netflix? I was thinking the same exact thing. And how much does Netflix go up a month? Because you, you, it's got to go up again. Well, they did just announce yesterday, right after they signed that deal with uh, Netflix, that Netflix is dropping their lowest tiered price. The The one with ads. Which is still wild that they would drop that, but. Booga booga. Buddy late in the way. And I'm dead. It's Netflix. They don't care. Uh, they, they care about making their shareholders happy. And I'm dead. You're just going to legally stream it now? I mean... <coughs> you do you, man. I can't tell you the last time I've legally streamed UFC. <coughs> I don't think oh, I've dude. ever. I, I'm, I, I can... think I can speak for everybody here. We've all... Uh, watched a uh, pay-per-view uh, over on East Coast Streams. Or one of those websites. I, I wish they'd just go ahead and put AEW on freaking Max. Make it part of that package. Going I'm, back to uh, that Saturday, that UFC card that day is actually really good. And I keep dying. Is it? I, I didn't even bother looking. Aren't they running the Sphere that night too? Not gonna lie, I would love to watch some kind of event in the sphere. Play your cards right, Zach might buy you a ticket to fish. Yeah, because fish is playing the sphere in like April, aren't they? Yeah. Yeah, I'm 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 not I'm I'm not going to fish to get asked by a homeless man if I can give him a ride. But when I do that, I'll go to Wawa.
I, I really can't stand fish. Not because they don't make good music. I, I think they make good music. It's just Zach has made me not like them. It's elevator music, man. It's elevator music. Look, like, you know, you're into what you're into. Like, yep. good for you. You do you. I'm, I'm not one to judge by any means. Nobody needs to see a band 20 times. I do think the idea of fish is cool, where how you go to a show, you don't know what you're going to hear. Because they they have so much. Their back catalog's Remember? huge. Yeah, that, that that's cool. But at the same time, it's every show. If Zach really wanted to listen to every show. I love Zach, but if you really want to listen to every show, all he has to do is go download the set, uh, the freaking set list the night after because they release every live show on their website. And they stream it live too. Yeah. It's an excuse to go get fucking blitzed out of your mind. He might land a wook. She might not have teeth, but you know. I don't think he's too picky these days. And that's all it is. <laughs> that had two exits. Son of a bitch. Jaws of Darkness. Darkness. Ah, oh, the darkness. Oh, I lost the Oogie Boogie, man. It sucks. Oh, I remember this. This level. I fucking hate this level. Freaking spiders. Why'd I do that? Rip. Rip Arena. And I'm dead. Yes, continue. Oh no, not doing that level again. F that. Oh look, we're magically back here. After all that hard work. Such an amazing cut too. How much you want to bet we're going to spin the wheel tonight and I'm going to get some I'm going to get a bunch of games I don't want to play. It's going to happen. You can it feel it. Quite possible. Oh, well, well, that rip. That's an extra life. <clears throat> Dude, I jumped. Oh, oh, my God. What a joke. And come back up. There you are. <sighs> Light the eternal flame. Extinguish. Mm. 
Boys, I'm getting hungry. How long ago did you eat Chick fil A? Uh, that was at like six o'clock. A while ago. So I had to go to Walmart to go pick up prescriptions and, uh, It was right there, and Heather and I didn't feel like cooking tonight. Oof. I gotta jump on this guy, don't I? Yep. How did I know it? That save point would be glorious. Okay, this is permanent. That's death. All right. Come on, Mr. Spider. You're dead. He's there. Come on. Come back. Uh. Uh. Stupid bats. That was risky. <laughs> I get to work from home tomorrow. Hey, me too. You get to work from home every day. Lucky. Well, I've told you before, you could very easily find a job like this. Oh, I know I could. Something about going to the office still is the boomer in me likes. That and I enjoy the human interaction every now and then. And I'm dead. It's the last life too. It's not good. This is not good. Okay. Now I'm a shish kebab. Okay, that's fine. She sent me that video. Okay, that's fine. I watched that one the other day. Um. <coughs> Excuse me. <coughs> and I know what you mean by the boomer in you. I still love reading newspapers. There's just something that does it for me. Dude, that's not boomer. That's... Silent Generation type shit right there. Nah, that's Boomer too. I, I, dude, I can't do the newspaper. And I'm... Ooh, clutched up. I clutched that up. It was all my fault I was in that situation to begin with, but I clutched the F up. Give me this life. Should be getting ready to get another one too. Oh, I gotta use my inhaler. I completely forgot.
Mess that up. Oh no, I didn't. Don't want it. Nah, <coughs> whatever, whatever. Would have been just apples anyway. Wouldn't have been anything good. Excuse me, they're called wumpas. Wumpas, okay. Who's in my drive? Damn it. Who's in my driveway? Neighborhood cat. A jerk. Keeps coming around my neighborhood. Walking around my cars. Well, he can take a shit on that. Uh, the, the Kia Forte. Or not the Forte. The uh, Kia Soul that I'm renting right now. Fucking pussy. Pretty much. Car's a freaking cum bubble, man. It is a bright, a bright ass white Kia Soul. I drive the freaking hamster car. I I can't stand it. Why did you have to get a rental? I forgot to ask this. Uh, Princess. I'm not gonna be able to say the rest of that. Hi, Princess. How are you? Um, I actually got in a fender bender like a few weeks ago. It was like January 3rd or 2nd. I got in a fender bender right outside of Walmart. I was picking up prescriptions and it was like when I was really sick, I was in the turn lane by, um, or not in the turn lane, but that road in front of, um, uh, Walmart where you can go to like, uh, damn it. You can go to, uh, Burger King and Wendy's and all that stuff. Oh, I hate that place. People drive like fucking idiots. E yep. And I was still in the area where it was still one lane and it like splits into two, like heading towards beat ups. And I was turning left and a lady tried to go around me on my left side as I was turning left. So you can imagine how that went. She ended up having more damage than I did, but it was like the lady was a complete bitch to me about it. And I was just like, look, lady, it, you kind of rear ended me. <laughs> I was unintentional on both sides, believe me. So you got into a little Zach is what you're saying. It wasn't. Uh, no, Zach got Zach got it bad. Heather told me uh, yeah, saw the car today. Um, she says it, it looks better in person. But uh, <laughs> it don't look that good I'm, in still, I'm still not convinced that he doesn't have some amount of blame in the situation. You played the remastered and you loved it. That's good. I haven't played the remaster of this. Um, yeah, I, I think he had something to do with it. I'm still not unconvinced he wasn't fucking blasted. But. Yeah, I, I don't think he's <coughs> innocent. The cops saw a guy with no license and probably stopped even thinking of Zach as an issue. Mm-hmm. I don't disagree. We're about to get the save point. How many lives do I got left? Hello? Oh, this is my last life. Great. Good. We'll get we'll get some lives back here. <coughs> and we can get a save point. Just don't die, Jake. That's all you have to do. That won't kill me. Whew. Anyway, um, I even said to my insurance company, I was like, I... I not even 100% want to get this fixed. I'm more so calling you because she's going to she's going to file a claim. And my insurance company already ruled for me anyway, so they were like, yeah. As far as we're concerned, you got rear-ended. I mean, if you got rear-ended in Maryland, it's automatically <laughs> her fault. Yeah. Yep. So dealing with that 
and I've already told her, uh, her insurance company's called me twice now, and they're like, hey, we need to get a statement from you. And I was like, uh, no, you don't. You, you, you can, can go fuck yourself. You can go call my insurance Sorry, company if you need one. Okay. I don't care. Okay. You can go F yourself. That's pretty much, I said that in the very nicest way, and the girl, one of the girls I work with, she was just like, that was the nicest bitch voice I've ever heard you have. And I was like, well, she can... They don't have to interview me. I'm not. There's no point. Uh, I'm going to play this, but it doesn't have portals to the bonus stages. Really? That's yeah, weird. You guys pay for your they yep. For you. I was like, I'll let Geico deal with this. You guys are going to end up suing each other anyway, so. The hell? Oh, okay. Yeah, like that. That didn't that throw you off too? It's like what? I was like, well, Jake's dead. Yeah, I thought I was immediately dead. Ah, uh, now I am. Now I'm dead. <clears throat> I feel like there's a secret here. In the remastered version of this game, have portals? I have no idea. Do it? Does it? The sad part is I have the remastered version of this game. I just never played it. I think I have it on my PS4. Which I couldn't tell you last time I booted. Are you winning, son? Am I winning, son? What's up, Bane? How you doing, dude? Hope life's treating you well, dude. Uh, are we winning? Uh, you know, are do you ever really win at anything? Yes, I'm winning this game at NHL right now. Nice. You playing threes? Hell no. I'm playing hut. There's a champions tournament going on right now. Is it uh you playing 24? Yes, sir. I saw it was on sale the other day. And I almost bought it and I was like, I would never play it. Unless I was playing with you guys. Uh good just shooting Pokemon with a crossbow. Nice. So you're playing a uh, freaking Pal World. I need I need to play it. Maybe I'll play it this weekend. I don't think I have any changes at work to do. So. Oh, that's bait. Yes, give me this. Do I just fall? Okay. I don't like this. I don't like the, the, the blind falls. All right. Checkpoint. That's good. Yeah, I was thinking about it earlier since we were talking about AEW. The only thing I'm really looking forward to of theirs is Sting's retirement. And I'm just like thanking my lucky stars it's not Ric Flair in the match. Yes, Jake is playing Crash Bandicoot. What, what, what do I do here? Hello? Do I blindly fall? What do I do here? Oh, I blindly fall. Okay. Good to know. Dude, I, I really don't like those blind falls. All right, good. Now we got some safety lives. Uh, 
Checkpoint. It's got to be near the end. It's got to be the last checkpoint, right? As much as I need those lives, I'm not not playing that game. That was a lot of free lives. It was. Pretty dangerous, though. That's why I passed. Remind me to add portal to the list, by the way. Portal and um Oh shoot. Just the original? Yeah. Because I, I I'm sitting here thinking about it and I haven't played it. The seeing those one enemies made me think of it. I have not played Portal before. Oof. We beat that with not too many uh too many deaths. I missed a crap ton of boxes, I know. You should add Half-Life 2 <coughs> to the list. Half-Life 2, that was the other game. Or Half-Life in general. I, I have them, but yeah. I've just never played them. Alright, we got two levels left, boys. Or three. Two or three. I think it's three. Half-Life 1, I don't think has aged well. But Half-Life 2 definitely has. Nitrous Brio. Old PC original. But that's like one I could beat in like a couple hours, right? Half Life Two might take me a couple days. I remember it taking me a couple days. Alien Ant Farm cover Smooth Criminal is a banger. Well, no, duh, it's Alien Ant Farm. Do I know how to beat this guy? So I have no idea. I safety stated, but oh, you gotta spin the things into them. Spin the things into them. Okay. Again, because you were spinning and they were bouncing. That's my guess. Stevie, are you just like listening to like two thousand three hits or something? Is that what you're doing? I mean, I'm not hating you for doing it if you're doing it. Oh, okay. I see what you gotta do. You just gotta avoid. You gotta bounce on these guys. Yep, that does it. Okay, I know how to do it now. Basically, you're listening to the American Pie soundtrack. That's honestly, you got Alien Ant Farm. You probably got some Sum 41 on there. <laughs> we still need to do that uh, 2000s movie night, Stevie. Oh, no. Oh, okay. Frank and Dick here. That didn't... I have no idea what happened there. Be 100% honest. I don't know. I can't jump on that until it... Yep. Zoomers were hating on new metal. I mean, it is what it is, man. They didn't grow up on it. I get it. As long as they don't hate on uh, skate uh, ska, I'm 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 cool with it. Ska's my shit. Oh, 
No, that's just dad rock to them, man. Wow. I suck at video games. <coughs> Clip it and ship it. I suck at video games. No, we're not doing that level over again. Oh, look at that seamless cut. American Hi-Fi. Wow, that's a name I have not heard in a while. Yes, I know what they were known for. Flavor of the Week's a good song. Oh, no. Anybody have any idea how to beat the last phase of this guy? Well, you hit him once, didn't you? I think, maybe? I don't know, we'll find out. <laughs> I think I hit him twice. I don't know, I hit him once. Yeah, I hit him, but I don't know how because it hits me too. You know what I mean? <coughs> All right. Time to break out the impatient millennial. Oh, God, he looks yoked. Bro is not playing around. Really? Well, I feel like a dummy. If that's all you do. Big fat dummy here. <laughs> oh no. Yeah, I'm gonna have to start over. Come on, Lee. Bring it on. Anybody else see that dude from uh Pawn Stars uh son died? Not the one that was on TV, but the uh, like it, the dude's brother died. And every outlet was using freaking pictures of Chum Lee and the, the one guy that was actually on the show. But yeah. Did you know that um, Corey, who you're talking about, yeah. and Chum Lee were addicted to meth? It's not surprised me. They got so fat because every time they'd have a meth craving, they'd have a bacon double cheeseburger. <laughs> he died of fentanyl. That's wild. Yeah, I feel like an idiot now that this is so easy. Yeah, you just jump on his head. It, it's typical Mario logic. I should have been following. Wait, wrong game? Yeah, that's the wrong game. Hey, achievement. I'm going to come back to this and be, uh, in like two years and wonder, why do I have so many save states? This can't be good. Ah, I 
it's timed. I knew it was going to be timed. Son of a bitch. Should have known better. Should have known better. Okay. Be an extra life. Oh no. Ha! Get wrecked. Oh no! It's a yellow blob! I don't know what it does, but I'm getting away from it. Ah, they got me with that one! You sneaky SOB. You got me with that one. I got got. I wasn't expecting it. I'll be ready next time. Nope. <laughs> that was a clever trap. I should have expected that one. Yep. That's fine. It's fine. It's fine. We'll just do it all over again. It's fine. It's fine. Oh my god, it's fine. Oh no, we are not doing that all over again. There we go. Look at that big tower Jake's climbing. It's so huge. 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 Didn't one of you all say in the group chat earlier that he won an, another state? He won New Hampshire. He won New Hampshire last night. Nice. He's going to be president again. More than likely. Yeah, I feel it. And I'm not here saying that that's a good or a bad thing, internet world. Just saying that's the truth. No, yep. We're just calling it like we see it. <laughs> <clears throat> we need a sports book to put money on that. <clears throat> if there were odds on him to win the presidency again, I would, I would bet it. I'm sure there's uh, some offshore casino we could do that in. Message train. Well, rip those. So, have I told you guys about the DMs I've been sending Lamar all season? So, after every big win that we've had or anything, like when he signed his contract, I just start he, his DMs are open, so I just start DMing him to see if he'll respond to me. And every single thing I've said has just gotten more outrageous. Oh damn it! I died. <laughs> I'm just waiting for him to turn off his DMs because people like me saying dumb shit to him. But apparently he's been responding to, to people. Dude, why does this guy look like Jerry from freaking uh Rick and Morty? I would imagine it's the point in the season where stuff like that would stop happening where he wouldn't be responding. Oh no, he's well he's been responding to some people on Twitter. He just hasn't been responding to DMs. Killed that guy. Get in between them both. Uh we're right there. It's last life too.
Ugh, I don't want to do this level again, but we're going to because I love pain and punishment. <laughs> then I want to beat this tonight and I want to do the wheel just to make Rusty happy. Because Rusty likes the, the wheel. wheel. The big wheel of games. It's a game show that you can't lose. Well, kind of can lose. You could be stuck not playing something. I, yeah, well, as a viewer, no, absolutely not. There's, there's no losing as a viewer of this, of this stream. <laughs> you might lose a couple brain cells, but you know. I've yet to lose a hair bet with Stevie, so he keeps betting me that the Steelers are going to make the Super Bowl. And I go, no, every single year I go, no, 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 no. I'll shave my head if they make the Super Bowl and they have yet to make it. So we're three years strong with that. Like Zach transported. Uh, Stevie's Canadian. We don't we don't really talk about it, though. Still big for them to get Deuce Daly. I mean, I guess if you... That's going to be big for uh, their running back room. I mean, yeah, I guess. They have like one and a half running backs. Uh, Warren's pretty good. Yeah, Warren's... He's the, he's the one in the equation. Uh... <laughs> I was saying it was going to be good for Najee because if Najee puts on maybe like... Five ten more pounds, he could actually probably be a decent power back instead of whatever the hell he is well, right now. Their problem isn't their running backs; it's their. It's, their, it's always been their line. And they also don't have a quarterback to threaten the defense offensively. So I mean, people just are ready for the run against them. What the hell's this guy doing? Dude, if I would have ate it there, I'd have been kind of pissed. Saved it. Really? You guys are really going to make me do this. That could have gone so horribly wrong. Oh, he respawns. He's like big boss, isn't he? Oh, I'm not there yet, dude. Oh, I gotta wait for the floor to spawn. That would be great. <clears throat> oh my god. I can't hit the dude with the okie doke to save my life. Alrighty, folks. I am heading to bed. Alright, man. On the, flip side. the flippity flip. The flippity flip. Flippity flip doing the hippity hip. I died there? How'd I die? <laughs> this explosion got me. It's like how Crash nonchalantly looks at the camera as he just kills somebody. Just casually committing murder, no big deal. He's a bandicoot. He does, he does what he wants. He does what he wants. 
I'm stuck in a death loop. Let's be real. the timing we are literally one level away from the boss the big boss nope I need the Ooga Booga guy Continue. We should have a safe spot right there if memory serves me. <coughs> we do. Doing the spinny maneuver. This is gonna make me rage quit and go watch Pittsburgh Dead. Checkpoint. We got electric boy again. Ooh, tickle fingers. Mm-hmm. Tickle <laughs> Damn it, Rusty. Tickle fingers. What? Ugh. How does he even live? You think his thing is like a... an eel? Oh my god. <laughs> is it like an electric eel? Does that mean instead of shriveling when it's cold, it shrivels when it's out of water? Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. This went from uh, PG-13 to rated R pretty quick, didn't it? He can't even say he was in the pool because he can't go in the pool. Oh no, he'd kill everybody. Oh my god, I'm a dingus! Been doing this for two hours, Rusty. I'll we're only to the end. Like the, the this is the last level before the big boss. Like we're we're right there. That's the only reason I haven't given up tonight. <laughs> Normally I would have been like, F this. <laughs> we're doing something else. But no, we're 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 very close. 
and it's been good conversation. Yeah, not too bad. Tanner stopped and said hello. Oh, nope. Don't like that. Don't like that either. I could have made that. Gonna make this though. And life. Tickle fingers once uh, another go. Oh my god. Fingers cousin wants uh wants some now. Oh no, this is bad. All right, we're back to where we were. F off, dude. Get wrecked. Both of them reset. Okay. Ah, oh, right there. Dang it. Time that all types of wrong. Okay. That's how the mechanism works. Nope. I'm dead. Another checkpoint there would have been just grand. Wonderful. Nah, I don't do that for you. Nope. Oh, I thought I was smushed there. The timing that is so... Dude, like, how do you time that? The timing is so off in that room, the cycles. What? Oh, come on. Come on. Oh. 
Dude. I didn't die there. I should not have died. I was hidden behind the machine. Get all the way over here. All right, electric fingers boys over there. I'm not gonna rage. I'm not gonna do it. Nope, I'm better than this. I'm not gonna rage. I'm gonna rage, Rusty. Don't do it. We better get like Toy Story or something for the next game. Oh my god, I got extra life. Okay. Okay. Okay, so we're in here. This one. Oh. oh my god. I gotta do TNT jumps. Oh um, point at least. Nope. It's the ending. But I gotta do TNT jumps at the end to get to the check or to the ending. Oh, Nope. All right, I, I can beat it this time. This cycle, I'm going to beat it. I can feel it. I can feel it. It's going to happen. There's Yidus Megidus again. Electric Fingers is back. Tickle Fingers, as you call them. Mm -hmm. It's Emperor Palpatine. <laughs> You know, biggest missed opportunity in the Star Wars franchise is doing that prequel movie. I well, thought not. It's not a tale a Jedi would tell. I should say one of the biggest missed opportunities. Yeah, I saw an article where they were talking about how, like, if they want to engage new and old fans in the story they should not be making the Ray movie and they should be going backwards in time not forward in time yeah 
Which I'm not against, like a Ray movie with Dave Filoni making it, but you know, you know, if Dave Filoni writes it, it from a character standpoint, it's gonna be really good. And then freaking um, uh, Favreau got greenlit to do a Mandalorian feature-length film. I, I, that I'm okay without, to be honest. Well, I imagine that's how they're gonna end this the series is with the movie. Only makes sense. <laughs> I thought it had legs that you could spurn off characters from it, but Well, they kinda did with Ahsoka. And they were supposed to do that with the girl who made those anti Semitic comments and got cancelled. The MMA chick. Cara Dune, Sean's uh, lover. He was obsessed with her. He likes the muscly ladies. He wanted somebody to call mommy. You know, I. <laughs> Meredith just went, ew. <laughs> Meredith doesn't understand mommy fetish. <laughs> Sean doesn't want to pull a girl's hair. Sean wants a girl to pull his hair. Oh no. I'll be back. I'm refilling my drink. Yeah, dude. Oh no. The bad part is next time Meredith sees him, that's all she's going to think about. <laughs> nope, dead. I probably could have ran a little bit longer. <coughs> what am I doing? Sitting here being all stupid and whatnot. That like legit scared me for some reason. It shouldn't have, but it did. Dude, come on. I had the timing down. I'm going to know this part of the game like the back of my hand now. Can I say one more thing about Sean that might take it a little past PG-13? I don't care. He, not only does he want a girl that will pull his ponytail instead of him pulling hers. Oh, no. Well, Meredith says he wants a girl who he, he can choke, which is actually true. Yes. Yeah, I can see that in Sean. But he also wants a girl who will put her fingers in him the way he puts his fingers in his bowling ball. I mean, I'm not here to kink shame, so what laws is consensual? <laughs> Mm. It's one thing I could never fathom. He's not in here, is he? Uh, not that I know of. No. Bunch of other people are. They have no idea who that is, but. <laughs> it says O Dub's in here. Is he lurking? Yeah, he he's playing uh, Apex. <laughs> they got a big they, they had a party of three in their discord earlier when I logged on Just a big lurker
Oh my god. Okay. It's all about the timing for this. Next cycle. Not this cycle. Next one. Nope. It's almost there. Now it's there. What? Oh my god. Nobody saw that. Oh, no momentum. <coughs> that was terrible. Just terrible. It's just terrible. Your boy Embiid getting a 70 the other night is still wild to me. It's the only game. Him and MJ are the only two players in history to score 65, get 15 rebounds, and 5 assists in a game. And his post-game interview was so funny, because they asked him about it. They were like, you've done something that only you and, Mike and Michael Jordan have done. How does that make you feel? And he goes, and he looks at the camera, and he goes, what? Wilt didn't do that? You lying. Yeah, I would have thought Wilt would have done that. He's like, nah, you lie, you wrong. Wilt, Wilt must have done this at some point. Just, like, just playing it off, because he's starting to pass <laughs> Wilt on a lot of 76er stuff. Did Wilt, Wilt play for the 76ers? I know he played for the Warriors when they were still in Philly, but. Yeah, he was a big Sixers guy. I'm dead. <laughs> most of the. Six or franchise records besides the few that Iverson got. That was almost catastrophic. Dude, I'm going to I'm going to be able to speed this level after tonight. Like I'm just going to know it. Damn, you're still on the same level. I know. It sucks. That, that final little jump. This part right here I keep getting stuck at. You just gotta time it just right. Nope. You think you can jump that far and you can't. Like the the death perception in this game is so much different than like Mario 64 where you can <laughs> kind of judge things a lot easier. At least I think you can in those games. But it's probably where I've played them more. Damn it. I really think you can do that run through those gates right there with just one straight through run. Oh, come on. The one time I don't hit him with the okie doke. fired their coach and hired Doc Rivers in the same day and the Bucks aren't even a bad team <clears throat> it from what I was hearing on the radio earlier 
he's got an issue. Uh, Giannis had an issue with the coach. Which is how today's NBA is anyway. Well, that's part of the reason why the Sixers got rid of Doc in the first <coughs> place. They needed to, but Harden making a big stink about it had a lot to do with it. And the funny thing is Harden's not even there. Nope. He fucking caused all that division in the locker room and he, he bounced. And Doc's known for having good bigs, so... It's just kind of wild. See the Pistons and the Wizards made a trade? No. Wizards took on somebody's contract. And, uh, like 12 million of the dude's contract. Just to get two second round picks. And I was like, two second round picks is like, in the NBA, that's nothing. Like, yeah. and they're probably just going to release them anyway. The end is in, is is near. The end is nigh. Got it. Got it, bitch. <laughs> coming home. He's uh, uh, That's not him coming home. That's him going to uh Oh no, there's another level after this. Okay. I, I'm assuming this is some kind of boss battle, then it's the And then it's the big boss. And then it's the big boss fight. I'm assuming it's a this is a boss rush. Or it's just a BS level. Okay. They gotcha. Dude, that was about to be Donkey Kong Country 2 all over again. They fake you out in Donkey Kong Country 2. It's like... <laughs> you get the... Uh, you get the... You think it's the, the final boss and it turns out to not be. Alright, I have no idea what I'm doing here. Oh, I know what I'm doing here. This is easy. Not jumping off the the <laughs> Gotta come closer, bud. There we go one hit he just four hits five hits total it's wild if it's true ah come on hmm. i wish i could get multiplayer to work for this to work so we could play crash team racing or something Yeah, yeah, this emulator is really good. I'm sure there's a way to do it. Oh, you just reflect the shit at him? It's the green ones I can reflect. Oh my god. What is happening? Holy hell. <coughs> it's not a uh the easiest thing in the world, that's for sure. There's a learning curve there. Dr. Neo Cortex.
Dude looks like he's pilled out of his mind right now. Anybody else agree with me? He looks pilled out of his mind. Okay, two hits. Um, he's one shot. He's cracked. He's dead. <laughs> Please tell me that's all it is. Well, I'm celebrating, so I assume it is. GG's? Is that GG's? Defeat. Neocortex. Save Tawana. Nice. That's what Sean wants right there. He wants his girl to pick him up in the air. He'd probably like that. We really getting credits here, Rusty. Damn, that was easy. Yeah, that, that, that boss really wasn't that bad. Oh, well, that's another game down. <clears throat> I guess I should probably get the wheel ready. I don't even know who's still really here. Dub's here in spirit. Uh, Press one in chat if you're real. Press two if you're not. Press three if you like cookies. Looks like Stevie probably went to bed. Yeah, Stevie went to bed. Knowing him. Oh, man. Kind of glad we beat that tonight. It means Friday. I think Friday we start the next game. Unless I feel like streaming tomorrow night. Actually, no, I might have dinner with my dad tomorrow night. We haven't done that in a while. That's pretty sweet. <coughs> I think we're going to Texas tomorrow night. Texas Rodas. Yep. Anything at the end of the credits? No? Oh, okay. GG's. It's another game beat.